What is up guys, we are back with some more Pokemon Shield Nuzlocke and we, uh, I believe we did our first wild encounter on this route. Um, now we're heading up to Garden City for our fourth gym badge. Um, for those that don't remember, here's our team right now. Teardrops, Nikki, Sarpex, Checkmate, Neo, and Shimmy Sham. I haven't done anything since we last left off and I'm actually hoping that this battle coming up right now isn't bad at all i forgot what pokemon they have looks like he has a great ball in his hand and i can't tell what she has in her hand as far as the pokeball ah partnered in a togetic or togetic ah papa I guess we might as well just... Yeah, I was, I was thinking about it. I was like, should I just use Discharge? But nope, that'll take out Teardrops for sure. I think we'll just focus on Togetic right now because I don't think the Ponyard is going to do that much damage. Unless the Ponyard is going to set itself up for... Are oh, you gonna use Fairy Cutter? Oh, and you're using Yawn. Okay, that just means we're gonna switch out into Neo. And we're actually gonna just raise our defense now. I think Fairy Cutter does more damage the more it connects. So it's best to. Try to have Nikki prepared for that. I forgot what Torment does. Just because we can one hit KO that Ponyard. I was like, might as well take him out with Neo. Ah oh, yeah, level ups. Level up galore. I just kind of wish we did more damage there. If I had Spark, this would work out better just because we could get that super effective hit. Oh, that's what that does. That's will extreme speed. Oh yeah, that did a good amount of damage actually. So I'm guessing Togetic just has like a really good uh, special defense. That's the that's the only guess I I have for it on why we weren't doing that much damage. Oh wow, we crit when you have like one HP left. <laughs> Alrighty, let's uh, make sure we we heal up the team before moving forward. I'd hate to to lose somebody on like an unfortunate. Uh, attack. I'm really hoping you guys can't hear like the music coming from my headphones. I see the mic picking up on something, but I'm not sure if it's outside background noise that I can't hear because of my headphones or if it's just the music in my headphones that it's hearing. Okay, that did more than I expected it to do.
Okay, good. We got the confusion. I'm about to switch out into Sir Pex, actually. Oh, wow. You used Bulk Up. Okay. And you snap out of it that fast? Wow. I'm actually surprised. Because it's like I never snap out of confusion that fast anytime I play the game. I think up here is when you can get like more uh, fossil stuff. Yeah, fossilized fish. I think I think you get that one like depending on which version you have. Oh good, we know Dig. Um, I don't know if I want to teach that to Neo or not. I think Neo can learn Dig. Oh, Trap Inch. I really wish this was my wild account. I would have threw Trap Inch on for Sir Pex in a quickness. Just to have a, a Dragon Ground type on the team. That would have been clutch. Oh my... Why? Oh, I totally forgot to heal up Teardrops. No! Oh my gosh. I don't know why I forgot to heal up teardrops, but I was also thinking we were going to one hit KO Trap Inch. I didn't expect us to get it down to so little. Wow. Rip to teardrops. We almost had Inteleon on the team too. I was looking forward to that. Wow. Oh man, this really sucks, so... Man. Man, Coco, Zelda, and Teardrops out? Um... Let's see, we get a dark... Well, we already have a dark type on the team. Either I can put Puddles in... Um, or I could switch it up and give us Tank Buster because he's a ground ghost. I could also teach him Dig. Or I could put Snarl Fang in. And that'll give us a Dark Fairy. But like I said, we already have a Dark type on the team. I think I'm going to just go with Tank Buster. Um, that's probably my best bet. I'm really looking at my team and it looks like it's almost balanced as far as like special and physical attackers. I guess the only thing to do right now is check if I have... Um, any of the EXP candies to give. Oh yeah, I definitely do. Let's see what level that puts you at. 29. Okay, that never misses. We're gonna get rid of Astonish. We don't need Curse. Um, I don't think I want Nightshade. Stomping Tantrum. Okay, yeah, that seems like a good ground move to get. I forgot what level this Pokemon evolves at, too. See, I want to use this, but I feel like it's going to give it too much EXP. We'll see. Okay, no, perfect. Oh, uh, we don't want Mega Punch. Oh, this is actually a great time to give it an item that will help increase, like, the damage it does with ground-type moves. Uh, not like clay. Soft sand. 
Dang, I'm really disappointed that we just lost teardrops on that. I wasn't expecting to lose teardrops right there. And actually, I need to put someone else out front. Uh, cause... This is not the move for... For hard-hitting Pokemon, now that I think about it. I'm not worried about that wild encounter. I just lost teardrops, bro. Ah, uh, what do you have? You look like you would have, like, Psychic or Poison or something. Or Dark. Okay, you have Poison. Poison Bug. Which works out, because I'm starting off with Sir Peck, so we can Peck away. See, I'm actually surprised we're not doing more damage. I feel like we should be one-hit KOing with these super effective moves, but maybe that's just me. I really just can't wait for Ponyo to evolve into Bishop. And I'm kind of wondering who to swap out Serpex for. Because I think endgame I really didn't use Serpex a lot like that. Okay, great. Another good reason to start off with Serpex. I think I want a Psychic Pokemon on the team. And I have... I have a Psychic Pokemon in the box. I just... What is that gonna do? Okay, not that much. Oh, wow, that was the critical hit. Perfect, so now we can get some more hits in. I'm trying to decide what Psychic Pokemon, because I don't want to use the uh, the one that I have in the box. I've never actually used it in like any Pokemon game, which might... Why are you getting crits like back to back like that? That's crazy. But, yeah, I'm really trying to decide like what Psychic Pokemon to put on the team. I don't know, I have a thing for Psychic types, especially if they look very majestic and cool. I was really hoping for like a Routes or something. But I did not get one. Uh, yeah, there we go. I was like, where's what item did I need? Steel Wing. And I see that glowing patch of water there too. Um, I'm not going to be fishing because I already used my Wild Encounter. And I don't think I really need more water Pokemon like that. But I will get that shiny object there. Oh, rare candy. Perfect. I don't think I get enough berries out here like I should be. I like how it shows like three berries dropped. Then it'd be like, oh, only one berry dropped. And you're kind of like, bro, how? Alright, let's fight it up, bro. What do you have, like a smear goal or something? Oh no, you have a coffin. Okay. 
kind of confused on how you're an Arsh and you chose like a really ugly Pokemon, I guess. This is why I need uh, a Psychic type so I can take out Poison types with ease. It's actually be like a great time to like put in Tank Buster, but I. Oh my. We, we didn't lose, we didn't lose Serpex. I was actually surprised that they went for a self-destruct. Pseudo-Udo. Uh, we're gonna go for Shimmy Sham. I'm not sure if Pseudo-Udo knows any ground-type moves, or else I would've sent out Nikki. Nikki or, or uh, Checkmate. Okay. Got a little twerk action in there. Oh my god, that did a lot. Oh, because it was a crit. Well, let's not miss. Poor favor. Everything just out here hits us really hard. And we got a crit on that too. Okay, that's that's fine with me. I, as long as we didn't lose anybody. I thought we were about to lose our packs when that cocker did self-destruct. I don't believe we have a battle when we come into the town. I think I can... I'll just, like, go heal up, yeah, and then we can head over to the gym. I just don't think we'll be able to actually face the gym. Or face the gym leader, I mean, in this gym. But I'm thinking I want to start, start off, like, this whole thing with checkmate. Checkmate might be, like, the go-to here. Just because we got that, um, that muscle band, I think, is what I have on him. So we deal more damage with physical attacks. Oh, let's see. Yeah, we'll buy that. Even though it's not like I can really use it. Oh, yeah, I have two of those, actually. That's fine with me. Let's go get the items back here. I think there was a TM up here. I'm not sure. And then I think there's also a guy up here that wants to trade a Pokemon. I can't remember which Pokemon it is, though. Or if this is how you can also get an Impidimp. Yeah. Maractus. Which I don't have. I guess it'll be good to put a uh, metal coat on checkmate when we get to the fairy gym. I don't know. Either we're gonna put metal coat on or we're gonna keep the muscle band. It's it's one of the one of those options. Either way, we're gonna be dealing extra damage. Oh, uh, what's up, Hop? Still down on your feelings, bro? Oh yeah, okay, here we are. We're about to battle him now. I should have started off with Nikki. This actually would have been like a great time to have a uh, Pokemon that gets healed when they get hit by a water type. Oh man, I wanted to look at the summary first. Because I was actually thinking about putting Nikki out there because uh, his Cramorant might know a flying type move. Uh, let me look at the summary. 
So it's obviously not you. So we need rain. Oh, that's what your ability is? Okay, that's kind of lame. Okay, let's switch to Nikki. Hopefully this was a smart switch out. Um, I'm not sure if we're faster or not. Okay, good, we're not. Okay, cool, now you're gonna spit the fish out. Yeah, we already know. Spit the fish out, bro. At least it wasn't a Pikachu that he picked up, though. Because if it was Pikachu, we would have got paralyzed, I believe. I think every time they spit a Pikachu at it, you get paralyzed. But okay, so the Cobra. Yeah, now we'll switch back into Shimmy Sham. I don't know, I think Bubble Beam does more damage than Mega Drain. Yep. So we'll go with the Bubble Beam. Dot, dot, dot. Oh, bye bye. Toxel. Yep, now we get to see Tank Buster in action use that new ground move that I've never used before. <laughs> Stomping Tantrum. I think 40 or 45 is the level that Tank Buster will evolve at. I'd have to check. Uh, Rab Boots. Um, back to Shimmy Sham. It was either Shimmy Sham or Nikki, but I wasn't sure if he had anything for a water type Pokemon or electric type on his Rab Boot. It was, it was one of the two. Oh good, you're, you're gonna use double kick, cause that's basically the only thing you can do. I really wish he had more Pokemon on his team at least though. Maybe if he had the coffee with self-destruct he could've took someone out. But alrighty, we just defeated Hop again. And we didn't lose anybody on this run. Thankfully, it was already enough that we lost teardrops. I didn't want to lose teardrops. I wanted to make it to the end with teardrops, but I guess not. And then you just be popping out of nowhere, girl. What you doing, Opal? So you just want to share Alistair's card? Okay, that's fine. And she's like, I'ma go watch y'all. Don't mind me taking a million years to, to climb up these stairs. Yeah, that's so rude. They didn't want to just heal us up. I forgot if it's before or after the gym when we need to uh, go see what Bead is doing. I don't know, I guess even without teardrops I'm kind of excited to see what this team's potential is going to be like. We got a couple tough looking people on the team. Um. But guys, I'm ending this episode off here. Next episode, we're actually going to challenge the Ghost Gym uh, facing Alistair. And for those of those, uh, for those people that don't know, um, this is one of the exclusive gyms for Sword and Shield. For here, it's going to be 
um, and, sh and sword, it'll be a fighting gym. And shield, it's a ghost. And then there's another exclusive gym as well that will be either rock or ice, depending on the version you have. But guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure you leave a like for the video. It helps with the video a lot. Not subscribe to my channel. It helps out the channel a lot. And with that said, stay sharp. Later.